Hey guys, Christy here and welcome to my channel. So today we are going to take a look at how you can add a contact form to your website in Canva. That's right. You can actually do this. It doesn't have to be anything really fancy or hard. And I'm going to show you the easy way how to do that. So we're here in Canva right now, and I'm going to assume you already have a website designed. And here we are now to the point where we need to create a contact page. Now I have already created this just so I can have it here to show you. And basically we are going to connect a Google form to our website and we're just going to make it really easy for whoever's visiting our website to see how to do this. All right. So here is the page. Now, the way I like to do it is to make it overly obvious where they need to click <laughs> because people just need visual direction. So what I did, I, I picked this um, little element here that kind of looks like a website page. I think I just looked up, let me see what this, this is called here. That's called browser window interface. So you can look up something like that if you want to have this look where it looks like a website page. And then I looked for a big green button <laughs> so that they know exactly where they need to press. So under elements, you can just look up button. Um, I'm gonna see what this one has on its information here. This one is called round game button, all right? So if you look up round game button, they have different colors too, they're not just green. They had red, pink, all kinds of colors, all right? So those are the two things you want. And then you wanna tell them exactly what to do. <laughs> so I said, click the button below for our contact form. That's it. On the next page, this is like a page, like a portfolio page if someone wants to get a logo or, or whatever. And so here I added, you know, a little information. Please fill out the contact form or email us. So I would prefer them to contact me through the form. So that's why I do this whole big shebang deal on this page first, okay? So all you're gonna do is you're gonna go to Google and you're gonna create a form if you don't already have one. So I have one that already made, and this is just for demonstration purposes, but you'll wanna edit the contact information for whatever you need from them, whether it's their name, their email address, maybe you want them to leave you a comment on more information about your project, whatever it might be. So once that's done, you're gonna get the link for that, I think you go under uh, get get prefilled link, or actually, or, or you can do add collaborator. I think if you add collaborator, you click on that, then that will you can copy responder link from here. All right, so you can do that, and then once you've got your link for your contact form, you're going to go back to your design here and you're going to link everything on this page okay <laughs> you're going to link everything because that way no matter where they click there are they are going to get linked to your page so that's what i did and i linked the the big web looking element here i even linked the text and i also linked of course the big button so once you do that, then you can uh, click, uh, you're, you're gonna have to publish your website again. And that's because anytime you make any changes on your website in Canva, you have to publish it, uh, which I already did. So I'm gonna uh, just click preview on here and it'll show me how everything is gonna look. So everything looks fine. Here's my contact form. We can see how to look on mobile. That looks good. So it's obvious where they need to click to contact me, right? So I'm gonna go ahead and, and close that. I'm going to publish website. All right, we're gonna continue. 
I've already put all this information in. If you haven't created a Canva website, uh, be sure to look under my playlist under Canva websites and there's all kinds of information on and videos on how to do that. So we're gonna go ahead and hit publish. Dum -bum -bum. And before you know it, we will have a website with a contact form that they can access. All right, so you get the yay, hurrah, and then click view website. And then I'm going to scroll down to the bottom to that page. See, here we are. And I'm gonna click the button and it takes me right to the form. Isn't that awesome? You can click the text, it'll take you right to the form. And then you can also click the web page as well. So there you go. That is how you add a contact form in your Canva website. That is the quickest and easiest way to do it. There currently is not a way to just natively embed a form into your Canva website. Maybe that'll be something down the road, but for now, I'm telling you, this is just the easiest way. You don't have to do you know anything complicated. You design your website, put your big buttons on there, and then you add uh, or uh, create your contact form in Google, and that's it. You are good to go. Your website will open it up, and then you'll receive those um, replies when people fill out your form by email. So there it is. So. I hope this video was helpful and I would love to know if you were able to add a contact page to or a contact form to your video and um, like this video and feel free to share it with someone that you think might appreciate it. <laughs> All right, so thanks a lot and I'll see you next time.